Welcome back, one and all, to the Brexit Estate, hard by the darkest dungeon where I have glorious news for all of you. Red Hook, the creators of Darkest Dungeon, have finally announced that they are working on Darkest Dungeon 2. And I'm pretty excited about this. I mean, yo, look, I've, I've had a nice long sleep, but I was pretty excited earlier when I found out, okay? <laughs> so, we don't know very much about Darkest Dungeon 2 yet. From the trailer, it seems that Wayne June will once again be reprising his role as the powerful narrator. And the heroes will be going out on a long journey away from a hamlet across the world which will be about as messed up and ruined as this particular area of it is and it will be quite post-apocalyptic there are it looks like recognizable hero classes will be returning <coughs> and they are nice and quirky so that's all great now with that established Sister Vindra gets to move up. Senate gets to stay where she is. And I believe it's time to head back after the Countess once more. But we've got good money this week. We can afford to do some training for characters who are much in need of it. Okay, we'll up that. Sister Vindra, we will increase illumination. Hmm, okay. Peace of mind and increase. Now, we have a character here somewhere who's level 5 with lots of level 3 skills. There we go. Right. I think once we get down to about 20,000, we'll be good. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Now, it's worth improving everybody because we don't know who we're going to be taking out next time. And of course, the heroes do keep gaining levels. So I'm basically spending down to about 20,000 and then heading in. Wow, so Galliard is just pretty good on skills. It would be nice to get something locked in here or treated. Ooh. That's pretty rough. That's ranged. Dodge and move resist. Might be worth keeping. I keep saying that, but I never reinforce it, so maybe not. Hmm. Okay, we'll treat that. Quite tempted actually, but not just yet. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's pretty bad. We're gonna fix weak grip on life. And with that, I believe we're ready to head off back into the courtyard to face the foul countess. Now, as usual, it's a very big dungeon, so we are looking less to um, I'm, I'm buying full stacks today. Why not? Um, that's probably going to be more torches than we need, to be honest. Uh, right. And then two big stacks of blood. Yes, so! Darkest Dungeon 2. Oh, that's going to be fun, isn't it? I'd better hurry up and complete this one then, I suppose, although it's probably not coming for another year or two. Wow. 
They have announced that they're going to put it in early access, same as they did with the first Darkest Dungeon game, and I wholeheartedly approve. And I'll also probably be grabbing that and showing it off as soon as it becomes available. Oh yeah, that's right. We will dig up this flower, flower pot. Alright. Some vile foes lie in wait. Let's bring them their doom! Vernon! Yeah, that's right. Thunder Vestal! A momentary abatement. Works every time. Oh, you beauty! Now here comes the onslaught. They may very well get to go twice before we have a turn. Sadie Vernon. Ah, with his flailing limbs. <laughs> Actually, we haven't seen much out of, um... Oh, I should know this, shouldn't I? But yeah, I mean, he's... The chap who did some of these skins. We haven't seen him do much recently. Maybe he's just really busy at the moment. I mean, the man has a warped and twisted imagination, but he does produce high-quality art. Oh yeah, just try it. See if he cares. Oh, big damage, big damage. Lady, you're gonna have to get angry if you want to live. Oh, that's nasty. Feel the fury! Just no, wait, hot, what? Okay, he can take it. Just be more careful next time. Yeah, get smacked. Disadvantage. Give them no quarter. Look, everyone, that thing can do group strikes. Defend yourselves. Dodge it all! Dodge everything! Don't get hit! And if you do get hit, hit them back! Harder! Alright. Now Vernon's been thinking. Vernon says, I've had enough of this. Oh yeah! Front rank Vernon, baby! You all know what that means! War can be healed, but never hidden. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Yeah, that's right. Just what 90 dodge! Just saying, you know, it's still got a hit in miraculously. Nice sound effect there. Go, Vernon! Kill! Decimated. The wounds of war can be healed, but never hidden. So, just a reminder at this point we're not here for the Countess, we're here for the treasure. You know, anything we can find, really. Oh, you? Uh, uh, Saren? What are you doing? There's a fight in this next room. Let's use it. In fact, let's all get tanked up on holy water. 
which used to hurt people who had the Crimson Curse. And now it seems to be okay. I thought there was going to be a fight in here. Um, I... Mm. <laughs> yes. Would you look at that now? Now we can camp. In fact, if we camp now, we'll get to use up some supplies. Gathered close in tenuous firelight, an uneasy companionship. Oh, you need. I know. Interesting. Well, we'd like a nice safe camp. Now, Vernon, what have you got here? It's the eye of the tiger. <laughs> Lose not your grip on the dreams of the past. You must fight just to keep them alive. Now, um, everyone, survive. And she has masses of stress. Vernon will deal with it. I'm sure he will. He's good at that sort of thing. Right. Are we ready to face the many dangers that lurk here in the courtyard? Of course we are! We've heard that Darkest Dungeon 2 is coming, and that is just great. I mean, if that doesn't perk us up, nothing will. I hate that I was going to interact with that. Oh, hello. Well, we won't complain. I don't think there's anything to use keys on here in this district at all. I mean, there are special plot related keys. For ca Ooh. That was unfortunate. Oh, you've got to be kidding. We could have got even more firewood. This is insane. Let's see what supply item we run out of first. Uh, my money's on shovels or... Um, actually, medicinal herbs, possibly. Alright. Now, this corridor we have cleared, though some new foes may lie in wait. Once we reach the end of the line here, we'll be in new ground. Uncharted territory. Yes, the word uncharted generally refers to uncharted seas or uncharted territory. There's normally a word after it. The word uncharted on its own is nothing. It's meaningless. You cannot call a game uncharted. Uncharted what, you idiots? Yes, there are some really stupid game names out there and they annoy me sometimes. And I don't play them. Right. I mean, why would you play something that annoys you? Unless you're, like, really into Dark Souls or something. I should probably upload some more of the Dark Souls videos at some point. I'm sure people would like them. Well, it's, it's Dark Souls stuff, you know, isn't it? Yeah. Me swearing at how frustrating the game is. Typical things, you know. <laughs> right. You know what, let's just get in there right now. Interesting. That was highly predictable. And also I was correct in guessing that one of them would get to go and guard her before Serum would get to go and use Iron Swan. Hence moving Vernon to the front. Might not have been an entirely bad idea. <laughs> oh well. Annihilated. There's one less enemy to worry about. You know what, we're going to have to get really sneaky here and just go like that. Rosnav knows what Vernon's planning. And he approves. Wholeheartedly. And again! This skill doesn't even affect enemies anymore. I'm not sure why it still flags in the attack skill. If 
we can finish you. Yep. Surges as the enemy crumbles. There goes for guard. No! Oh, I was going to get her as well. <laughs> Mark Simbo, that's interesting. Hmm. Oh well, Vernon. We should do Hey. Hmm. Yeah. Put a little bit of damage on there. It was a nice idea, but you're just going to have to take him instead. Obliterated. Excellently done, I say. Who guards you now, Craven Hag? Misbegotten misfit. You know what, everyone just... Yeah, we've got some stress to kill here. Worth a try for the stress removal. Compassion is a rarity in the fevered pitch of battle. Destroyed. Oh, 41 again. As victories mount, so too will resistance. We got loads of this. We don't need all that much. We're good. Once again, I'm filling in the gaps. You know, this is a known space. This could go anywhere. Because I know there's a corner here, right? So I know there's not likely to be much in this space here. This we're going to pass on but Okay, Seren needs fixing when she gets back to town. She is clearly just... Obsessed with something. Paranormania, of course, of course, of course. She doesn't have anything positive locked yet. Clutch hitter, maybe. Hmm. She's been doing these Crimson Court missions for so long, she deserves some kind of recognition. Speaking of which, hello. Drink that, please. There we go. Right. We'll deal with you on our way back. Um, anything? Oh, dead end. Well, in that case, yes. Let's plunge a torch into this throbbing hive of iniquity. Glittering gold, trinkets and baubles, paid for in blood. Okay, now let's see. Um, we'll just use the, sort the holy water for that. And, as per my guess, of the shovels ho or holy water, or medicinal herbs, yeah, I'm kind of, at that point, it's kind of like, yeah, any of these three things, right? That's kind of throwing mud, but, alright, let's dig it up. Uh, yep, that'll do nicely. We could, yeah, yeah, we will. Swapping the shovel for the paintings there because we don't need the paintings very badly in the hamlet. But hey, we're getting to work through this blood now, so that'll make room for a bit more treasure as well. Then I believe from here we're headed southwards. I'm imagining another mirroring, so that would go like that and then down as well. I don't like the way the Viscount was reached with virtually no fanfare. It was just very sudden and abrupt. The Baron felt much more established, firm, like this is what we're going to do now. Let's take some... Food and gold. To be spent. Oh, okay, we're going like this, are we? I'm trying to work out if it's going to look like some sort of giant insect. 
with all these legs constantly going back or, or like arms going up like a totem pole or something. It's interesting. Okay, wait. That paranormal mania is really bad. I don't even need to think about this. <laughs> Truly the courtyard is a murky morass, a den of evil that must be purged. Okay, we fight, we don't open the chest, we leave. Oh, you're determined, aren't you? Right. In that case... Up and at them, boys! Yeah, the Esquire's of a big threat here. A singular strike. Or at least they were. Now the Esquire is the big threat here. <laughs> Slowly, gently. I stand this by my point. Life is taken. Uh oh. That lets him do the big rapier lunge forwards, doesn't it? Oh, he chooses not to. And he is not fed. Interesting. Okay, two hurts. Let's do it. Okay, get up there, Vernon. You know it makes sense. Eradicated. Beautifully struck. Now, continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. Now, I do know I'm focusing fairly heavily on Mordheim videos this week, but I didn't want to neglect my other passions. So there's going to be some stuff from Darkest Dungeon and Kingmaker. I might even As manage to squeeze in another Call of Cthulhu video. A faint hope blossoms. A trifling victory, but a victory nonetheless. All right, all right. We'll take him that. Whatever happens. Um, uncommon. Uncommon's quite good, actually. Okay. So we are leaving at this point. So we're just piling on the stuff. Um, five each. Fifteen each. Yes. And with that, it's time to depart. We'll return to the hamlet. While we were not victorious in defeating the Countess, we have plundered plenty of her treasuries, and this will assist us in the coming weeks. Failure tests the metal of heart, brain, and body. Well, 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 what have we here? Oh, replaced Warrior of Light. But Rusnav, you should have... Oh, my goodness. That's getting fixed. Demon Ammonia. Oh, my goodness. Ah. Oh. <laughs> In time, you will know the tragic extent of my failings. So, Ren underwent effective disease treatment and no longer suffers from a spasm of the entrails. Kira is toughened up a bit and no longer likely to fall at the first blow. Rashida also is also a bit more sturdy. Kelder wanted to drink the blood but managed to avoid doing so. Right, we are going to go... Rosnav, you're getting that fixed, without a doubt. Vernon... got something nasty, didn't he? Well, Saren did. Can't have her believing she's possessed by demons. So, I can't manage, uh, Good luck, clutch hitter. Repla How long is that replaced going to stay there for now that it's locked? That could be annoying. 
Corvid's Grace, actually for Vernon that could be pretty good. But let's see, what do we want to fix? These are manageable, okay. Um, disease resist while he's got the Cribbage of Curse is not a problem. There are occasionally some beasts in the courtyard. So let's fix that. Alright, I suppose that brings us to the end of an episode. I'm just still pretty chuffed about the Darkest Dungeon 2 news to be honest, so yeah. I hope you're all excited and looking forward to Darkest Dungeon 2. Uh, and yeah, <laughs> it's just really good news. I'm so happy. Uh, so yeah, I'll um, I'll say bye-bye for now, people. I hope you've all enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you all in the next one. Cheerio!